Oh wait, I should have checked to see if that's saving the right spot. Probably is. Output oh, didn't change. Yeah, that's fine. All right, we all back. I believe so. I believe so. I think. Yes, I am here. Okay, there we go. All right, we're all back. Then. Nice. Uh, you good to go, Garf? Or do you still need a bit? Uh, no, I'm all set up now. Okay. So let's hop back into it then with some new music. You guys open up that doorway that leads to the upper. Uh, yeah, it's basically half. That's literally half of a house. And you are greeted with a hallway that extends left and right. And on the opposite side from where you guys are, four more doors. Hmm. <laughs> How suspicious you guys look. <laughs> Slooping around. It's like a Watergate scandal <laughs> fucking going on right now. Look, <laughs> ignore the, the microphones box. in the lampshades. <laughs> Forrest Gump is across the way, <laughs> fucking reporting you to hotel security. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, bliss. I don't yeah, I think they're trying to there. find a fuse box or something, because uh, they, they look around, the flashlights are keeping me up. <laughs> Someone's like, what the fuck is going on? Anyways, so, Good which door... Gump. Does Should we just What's start? behind door number one? No, <laughs> it's a brand new car! What's a car? Don't worry about it! It's a carriage. There you go, that's my... Brand new carriage. She started the edge one of Marco Weed. <laughs> Damn, horse on quid! Ugh, it's like... I have to get paid for my own gas or something, that's crazy. We have a troll and a giant dog. I think we can manage for a minute. Listen, I don't think Witch Stalker is gonna be your freaking happy <laughs> old animal, okay? He might have a lot of horsepower to him, but he's not gonna agree to that. Actually, Hacker. he has one warg power. I'm like, oh, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and it's 1.5, remember we buffed him? Mm, right, yes, correct. Mm. Hacker might do it if you give him enough food and alcohol. And a chug jug. <laughs> chug jug. Oh god, not again. That's what he's fueled on. But, uh, yeah, so what do you guys want to do? I will uh, move in and say it seems clear. Okay. Even though I haven't checked it. <laughs> no, it's not checked. It's not checked. I checked so the door. So we start at the top. Just go down one. I'll like just sort of work through each room one at a time. Up to you guys. Work are we done? I'll try the door handle, if there is one. There's a door handle, yeah. Unlocked. If there isn't one, you can try the old-fashioned door handle of boot to door. <laughs> Yes. Door handles on very all effective. Of these doors. Okay, you're in the middle of town, not in the middle of the woods. This isn't a cabin in the woods, okay? Oh god. And if it were, if it were the cabin in the woods, then we start making some new character sheets. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so, do you want to open the door? Yes. You open that door up. And I will use the according tools. Boop! Yeah. Uh, no, it's, it's quite large for a closet. Uh, no, it is something like a, a spare room. It just, There's a lot of different things in this that would perhaps belong in other archetypes of rooms. Uh, it is something of a closet. It is something of a storage place. It is something of a workshop place. It's a mishmash of different things. Isn't that right, Tango? Yeah. But, um, not particularly much in here of immediate note. Um, there are, off to the side as you enter to your left, not left on the map, but to, you know, your left upon entering, uh, boxes, crates stacked up against the wall. Uh, some of them are opened up and emptied out. You know, dust sort of getting kicked up as you enter into the room. Uh, to your right is a work table, like a workbench. Okay. Uh, tools of any kind? Uh, there are tools there, yeah. Tools include saw, screwdriver, the, the most universal tool of all, a hammer. <laughs> You're going to Adam Savage, at least. You can do pretty much anything uh, with a hammer. This is true. This is true. Is Looking there at the tools, I oh, go ahead. Sorry, I was just gonna see if there's anything that she was making there. Uh, no products uh, set there right now. 
Okay. Nothing, no, nothing that's like halfway through being made. Nothing or? in progress. Nothing hidden. Vice. You know, like the the grip. Um, tis clean. Okay. Are the boxes and stuff like like nailed shut, or are they just like closed? Like, would, uh, we, would we be able to open them without having to get a crowbar, effectively? The ones that you have access to, they are stacked on top of one another. Um, they are no chip. Mm. Is there any smell coming out of them? Out of the Jugs. crates? The crates, uh, yeah. Smells of uh, hay and stuff like that. You know, sort of uh, packaging and stuff like that, oh. one might say. Uh, other items in this room, there's a vanity mirror, sort of like just at the far corner of the wall that's sort of just chucked there. A vanity sort of mirror is there. like a really tall mirror you put on a wall. Like there. a tall standing okay. mirror, yeah, meant for, you know, seeing... It's meant for vain people mm -hmm. who, want, who, like, look at all of themselves. That's the term. Vanity. Uh, so other than that, mirror? there's like a, um, going along with the, like, ne not next to next to it, it's not like they're touching, but nearby the vanity mirror there's like a... God, what's the term? A folding curtain? That's the term. Yeah, I do have a question. Yes? Are there any windows in the house that look at other houses? I mean, uh, look at other houses from where you guys are right now. There's. Uh, the street itself is. Uh, here, let me just feel this segment. The so street the itself. Fire. Yeah, the street itself is in this area uh there are houses to the uh south and from the direction of the map down and right so what does this uh window over here see just an alleyway yeah an alleyway that uh is in between okay. the house to its right that's a really shitty Judging idea. by the dust, it's been a while since someone was I, in the storage I, room. I asked that because we know this creature was caught, like, watching people before. So perhaps one of our neighbors has seen something. Seen something, seeing them. There, that is a potentiality. It's like rare one. You guys haven't explored all the rooms yet. Uh, as for your question, Tandem, there's dust in the room. That's not to say that there's not, like, imprint in the dust, you know? Okay. Like, it's dusty from a lack of maintenance, not dusty as in, like, which I guess goes along with what you're saying, but there is a clause to it. It's Understood. dusty, but not trackless. Like, she has gone into this room before. Yeah. So more like the stuff she's working with is just very dusty. Dusty, either from actual dust or sawdust and stuff like that. Yeah, okay. What is in the next room? Which is which one is the next room you wish to investigate? Uh, this one? Numero doso. Yes. <laughs> Tis oh. a bathroom. Oh. Um. Well, I'll see you guys in a few. <laughs> 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 gotta make sure all the plumbing works. Yeah. That sounds weird. <laughs> you gotta go, you gotta dust, because it... Uh, anyway. I need like a bathroom cabinet, drawers, boxes. She have medication. Uh, there's a cabinet that goes along with the sink and stuff like that. Bathtub. Must be a I'll very a small fucking bathtub. Take a peek in the cabinet. Inside, candles, sorry, cosmetic items, cleaning items, etc., etc. Okay. Nothing unexpected. Cosmetics, right. cleaning stuff. What you would find anywhere. Do they seem like expensive cosmetics or are they just like just go down to the shop grab? I do not know. I do not use. That's why I was talking to the god of the world. <laughs> I don't know how, how, how experienced. Yeah, how experienced <laughs> are you with <laughs> cosmetic items? Well, I would be able to tell you whether they are expensive. I was just gonna bug Abigail, but sure. Can I, like, roll to figure out how nice these are? Or how, like, um... <laughs> you don't have to roll a shack, I can just tell you because you're a minius. 
Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Do I have to roll? No. Well, there's some things that some of you know that others don't, okay? And uh, I figure this is one of those fields. You lived in the capital, and you were not, unlikewise, we're not in the uh, poverty stricken side of the capital. <laughs> so, logically, <laughs> moving on. Uh, there are some things here that are expensive, that are uh, ornate, posh. Oh, wow. Most of it, however, like there's only but a few exceptions to the you know general thing of basic, functional, bare bones. One might say frugal. I don't know. Uncary. Okay, so she is a lady of taste, even if she wasn't of mean. Hmm. Interesting. Definitely. Acker begins grabbing food from the kitchen. Acker, Tony, do Acker! What? You're not here! We're trying it's not our house! <laughs> We're trying not to leave a trace. Do you want to get haunted, Acker? Because you will. This is how you get haunted. But she's still alive! Sort of. <laughs> Don't eat the food. We'll get you food later. Do you want to get your head ripped off? He can probably just Wait, if Hatker gets his head ripped off, does the head grow a new body or does the body grow a new body? We've had this discussion before. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember this. Yeah, we have had this discussion before. Hmm. And the conclusion was that uh, the head would grow back a new body. Because because that's, that's, how the, that's how the variant in the, in the Monster Manual actually does say how it goes. Huh. Yeah, there's a limb removal variant for variant Remote control. Remove some limbs. Yeah, where they, yeah, where like if you cut a, oh, the hand comes off, the hand is separate initiative AC CR thing that just is there while you're fighting the troll. So he can now punch you while the rest of him is fighting you. Because fuck you. I heard you like claws, so I had claws with your claws, so you could get clawed while you get clawed. <laughs> Anyways, moving on, my friends. Hmm. So, uh, where's the vanity mirror? Vanity mirror's on the bottom left. Yeah. Oh. I was off. Um, bottom left of the bottom right room. Right. I want you to do, like, the most detailed inspection around that area. In a physical the sense? Or the floor? Uh, when we... Well, yeah, I should ask, like, a physical sense? Like, a religious sense? Oh, so, if it's That's practicing different forms in front of the mirror... It might have left some indication of that. Yeah, I think that's right. Roll me a perception. Some Google mm. floorboards. Can the person with favorite enemy monstrosity help? Up oh, too late. Mm -hmm. 18's fine. <gasps> the mirror does not seem like it's been here long. That is very interesting. Neither does the curtain. Hmm. So, the person's like retrofitting this room. Yeah. One might say that. Hang on the back of it, make Walmart. Are the mirror on the curtain? Okay. I guess. The curtain. Well, I'll start with the mirror. Bye, Tango. Uh, mirror. Mirror's clean sleek on the back, polished. The back of the curtain doesn't have any claw marks or any, you know, uh, tarnishings or breakings or breakages on it. Although you do note that it does seem like moist, like uh, damp. Ew. I just had a You thought. guys are fucking, fucking, get the fuck out of my campaign. You guys are fucking <laughs> I wasn't this making any in windows there. It's just gross that the mirror is wet. <laughs> No, not the mirror, the curtain. Oh, the curtain. <laughs> no, no, it's okay, mold. I can it's make a joke. You get there. moldy. Yeah. Clean your house. <laughs> That's unhealthy. That's how you get black lung. Wait, no, black lung is cold. Shit. Black Have mold. You there you go. Is the rest of the room damp, or is it just the curtain? I guess it's the back of the room. That's just it's like, fun guy, it's, 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 it's like a. Uh, like a. Like a. I shouldn't say Japanese, it's just general. Well, there is a difference between Chinese and Japanese folk. Don't fucking at me. Uh, it's like a. 
a Japanese like folding curtain. You know, it's like has that sort of sleek, um, water treated, you know, parchment. Mm -hmm. You know, because Japan doors would be really fucked if <laughs> they get rain. Oh, I wonder if Japan gets rain. <laughs> no, yeah, no. The, Jap the Jap Japanese have thought of this. Okay. I thought the question, one... Rashin. Perhaps you should have this a similar thinking. Uh, is are all of the windows curtained closed? Yes. Are they all like? <gasps> is there a reflective like surface like the in the bathroom? Mm. Hmm. Is there what in the bathroom? A reflective surface. Ah, uh, there's not. Captain Jackman opens up the next door. You guys are discussing in here. Oh, he's gonna get it. <laughs> well, you can go in with him. It's uh, some sort of uh, bedroom. Does it look like this is the main bedroom? No. It's the you bed can tell nice from the... <laughs> yes, but you can tell from like the dust on like nearby cupboards and cabinets at this place. Unlike the room that you guys were just in and discussing about the mirror, this place actually does seem like it was not been touched not maintained no. and not touched like hmm. just by stepping in because you guys have outside res residue on your boots and stuff like that just by stepping in you guys are leaving marks in the ground because of how dusty it is in here dang that is, is there any like dust. smudges on the surfaces then in the dust nothing just dust okay. <laughs> so it's not been stuck and, um, and captain jacobin makes mark of this okay can i have a quick look under the two two bathrooms and yeah there are two bedrooms in it seems used. She's a very lonely person. A waste of coin for property value. Hmm. Why would she buy such a big house like, if she came here alone? He shrugs. Does she have uh, one of those uh, chests? Uh, what do you call them in. A bridal Robert? chest? Oh. Bridal chest? Interesting question. What's a bridal chest? It is a chest that you fill things from your gifts, from your family, that you keep after you marry, so that you are not moving into a home without anything. Well, she would probably oh, have that in, okay. uh, in our main bedroom, not this one. Mm. Can I take like, a quick look under the bed, or like under the mattress and stuff as well? See if there's anything You take there. a look. No chests or lockboxes or anything at initial glance. Is there anything at all? What I say is what you saw. Without oh, okay. making. Without making a perception would indicate otherwise, I'm at okay. liberty to care. May I do that then? We'll make uh, a perception check. Perception for under the bed and under the mattress. Ooh! Eee! Hey! Just one roll. Yeah, it's just one. You see nothing. Oh damn! So that was a waste of a perfectly good natural twenty there. But hey, <laughs> I don't add stuff to the world when you guys roll. Hell. I know, I know. The world You're is the world. Saved. Your twenty to one ratio did increase, saved it. so that's a win. <laughs> and we still don't have important rules. I just remember you the you the type of MF -er that cares only about his KDA in a team based objective based game. <laughs> you assume I play team based objective based games? Yes, you do. I play Hunt Showdown. That's like the only one. You play Dungeons and Dragons. Not that same. <laughs> <laughs> Got if, if we're judging by Got that, him. then O wins. End of discussion. The headshot sound effect is my favorite. Mm. I, I prefer the uh, Call of Duty hit marker. <laughs> Captain Jacobin opens up the next door, and this is the master room. Is there such a chest that Tanum was describing? There was. Da -da -da. There, it, there is. There shall but... be. There exists one within your current line of sight as you enter into the room. <laughs> is that one also it locked? Is it locked? It is. Well, I'll give it a shot this time. Okay. Would you want to help? I will help. Okay, cool. I'll whisper uh, advice Sweet over nothing. your ear. <laughs> oh, advice. Advice, <laughs> advice probably works a little better in this case. <laughs> Do it. I believe it. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, I, gotta yeah, drop this in. I gotta drop this in. So, in my real life campaign, there was someone that was 1v1ing, like a, a Nevros Ligratus, you know, chieftain. Uh, 
she basically fucking died, but there's narrative really? and character development in it, so it's okay. But one of the other people tried giving her their inspiration, and I was like, you can get, you can take their inspiration, but only if your character acts actually nicer to that character. Because so far, you've been pretty much a dick to this guy. Why would his words be inspiring to you if you're going to keep being a dick to him? So now she has to be nicer to him. And I'm going to laugh <laughs> so wonderful. hard when she fails. That's a <laughs> Yep. The grudging kind. By the way, uh, I have a fun new statistic. Uh, a level 3 character loses very quickly to a CR9 person. Huh, who would have thought? I remember fighting an Aulus, and it took a group of 6 level 6s to bring them down. <laughs> CR3, or no, level 3 versus CR9? She got smoked. <laughs> Don't worry, deal with the devil happened, and I made the smile like in general chat. Man, moving on though. Yeah, Sandra does borrow your tools. <laughs> yeah, you crack oh, open the yeah. bridal chest. Oh. Um, inside it are a series of smaller boxes. Not, they're not lock boxes. Well, they are lock boxes, but they're not locked. So you have to do fifteen uh, lock picks. Just <laughs> they're, yeah, they're things. not locked. Um, they're all empty, save for uh, just one, which has. Some coin in it still. Some Does, platinum. I don't know how I would determine this. Does it seem like there was stuff in there previously? Well, there had to be. Why the fuck would she just have a bunch of empty boxes? She's a, got a sick box collection. <laughs> yeah, boy. Captain Jackman does, you know, uh, pull aside with his hand uh, curtains and does, you know, comment on Russian's remark. You can see the other house over from here. What windows one? do not the windows do not align exactly, but you can still see into them. Hmm. Ground floor, I would say we're only wet. A few inches above the ground itself. Easy entrance, easy exit. Pulls the curtain back over. It occurs to me that the only reflective surface that is not covered in this home is the mirror that has been put yes, far in is, the corner of the house. That is very concerning. Do you see any traces of previous mirrors? I'll, oh. I will have to look again. I will look over the floors. I will sit you. Is there any, like, oh, sorry. I will thoroughly make a search of, of the floor to see if there are any scratch marks, drag marks of uh, heavier furniture. Maybe like faded faded versus not faded mm -hmm. wood of light shining on a yeah. mirror that was there. Yeah. You can try on the wall as well in case there's one hung up. Two. Yeah. <laughs> um, make me a perception check at advantage. I'm assuming you're all helping with this. In a way, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. DC will be pretty low as a result. Probably like six to okay. Well, that, <laughs> anyways, damn, you destroyed it. There were mirrors in this room. Um, there was no, there was, yeah, there wasn't any mirrors in the guest room in the first place, but things in there are pretty sparse, to be honest. So, not surprising. There is like the fading impressions of a mirror in the bathroom. So it mm -hmm. seems like they pawned off anything that they didn't want, which was makeup and a big ass mirror. And the sick. <laughs> Crash. Are mirrors in, in in this? Are they ma ma mainly like um, silver, or glass, or steel? Uh, that's. That's a good question. There, depends on which. <laughs> Social class you're in. If, if I remember, if my medieval knowledge is correct, I believe in terms of the most expensive thing, it would start at like an actual melted on silver, then glass, then steel. Is that correct? Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah. Um, well, glass wouldn't necessarily be because glass was very. It wasn't transparent yeah, it wasn't in the same sense. Right, right. Uh, so then, yeah, silver then steel. Steel, on the most part. Again, social class varies. Some are silver, some are not. Richer people would have silver mirrors, though. Okay. Have Have you noticed? Are there any any silverware at all in the home? Hey, Asker. Well, you found any silver uh, forks? <laughs> <laughs> Seeing us going through the kitchen, was there anything like that? 
<laughs> you see, you come out the top doorway and you see Acker who he has his hands tucked under his armpits like a sulking child. I give him one of my <laughs> rations so he can snack on things. Oh, oh god. Almost bites off your hand giving it over. Oh. <laughs> Ew. Good job. On the, the accurate audio. Uh, but yeah, I, <laughs> I, I look around in drawers and things to see if there are silver, literal silverware, like Fred was suggesting. None. Is Who there, is this like, Fred? She. <laughs> and some boyfriend. <laughs> Ah, uh, no silver in the kitchen. Before you at me, the clocks, internal pendulums, and mechanisms are not made of silver, they're made of brass. Damn. <laughs> what about in the workshop? Oops, shit. In the silver tools? They're not a, no, they're not any silver tools. I don't think I silver... don't know, but like... Oh, yeah, like, Unless you're doing like, uh, maybe That's something. A, a bad description, but like, you silver, know, like, materials out, and stuff. No silver materials in there, but that itself is not terribly surprising. <laughs> Uh, no, it just, yeah, it just occurred to me. Is there a That's bar right. of silver? No. Oh, uh, the captain <laughs> does come out and ask, any particular um, reason you're looking for silver? Well, I have spent many, many years as a mercenary fighting not only, uh, shall we say, uh, human enemies. And if you cannot afford a blade of magical quality, then... A silver edge will cut most things pretty bad. So, if we are dealing with something supernatural in that sense, I would imagine that you would not be keen on keeping silverware in the house. Hmm. Yeah. Is there... um... You make me wish I carry silver bullets. Not a bad idea in this. <laughs> not that the situation does not require it. So many concerns, people would start pulling off silver bullets for a silver coins or something. Also, Actually, really now that I think about that you mentioned coins, when you... Uh, Sandra, where are you? Hi! I come back. What's up? When you were looking at uh, the coin box, were any of the coins silver? Were they? <laughs> Was it just I don't gold know. or copper? Were they? You said I gold coins, didn't you? I told you them contents. I think it was gold. Platinum and gold. They were the only coins you found thus far. Whoa, somebody somebody that's a road worker having platinum, that's something. Not terribly it's not really? terribly unexpected. It's only ten gold to a platinum, remember that. Oh. It's not a hundred. No like, I guess if we're not in the twins where it's like a copper is something. Well considering the working conditions they you know, some hazard pay is warranted, I would imagine. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Not enough uh, in this case, because she got murdered anyways. Yeah, it's like Outer Worlds. Are you the closest living relative? <laughs> the closest oh, yeah. li living person relative to the time of death? Alright, you're paying for the funeral. Aw, oh, damn it. <laughs> um, I knew I should have been on break. Is there any silver jewelry in the bedroom? No jewelry whatsoever in the bedroom. Oh. Well. Fancy cosmetics, but no jewelry? That is rather odd. This is silly. Could I try, like, opening the little face of the grandfather clock that has, like, the actual hands and try moving them and seeing if there's any resistance when you hit, like, a certain number or anything? What, are you thinking, like, it's some sort of, like, safe? I'm I'm thinking it's some... It could potentially be some kind of <laughs> you lock. You feel resistance the whole way going. I mean, like, any particular resistance. Like, no. oh, you hit this one, it does that. Okay. It's the old stories of, oh, hey, there's something behind the grandfather clock kind of shit. I think it's some sort of fucking horror game or something. It might be. Maybe later, but... This is this looks a lot like the Resident Evil 7 house, minus one of the rooms should be off to the right. Hell yeah. And there's Wait, not centipedes. If I, gonna, if I were gonna give you a horror house, go look at Visage, alright? That oh, wow. house, everyone that plays that game is like, what the fuck is the architecture of this house? It's like... The basement has like two levels, but there's like three stories or some shit, including the attic. What the fuck is this house? Yeah, I give you one of those houses. Something immensely complex, needlessly so. Or it's like a mansion within a tiny house. Yeah. Anyways. <laughs> it's nice architecture. It just makes no sense. 
So <laughs> look at the map. It's like what the fuck? What do you guys want to do? Uh, you guys have some leads. Lack of silver. A uh, moist curtain. Yeah. <laughs> all the all the windows being covered. Oh, no, the well, I mean, actually... the windows being covered isn't that. Well, that do... that's not like a, that's not something terribly surprising. Does it, do, do the the window drapes? Do they seem like recent additions to the house, no. or have they been there? Okay, so yeah, maybe not. I mean, yeah, people cover their windows when they leave the house alone for extended periods. <laughs> Can I have the Yuila fly over oh, uh, outside to where the window nearest Rajan is and see what you can see in the alleyway outside? Uh, bins, trash bins, rat here and there. Standard okay. alleyway? Standard alleyway, nothing terribly. There's not a body hidden out there, not a trap door or basement door or anything like that. No drug deals at this time of night. Not in, the not in the residential. Why would you? Why would you do a drug deal in the residential neighborhood? I mean, come on. You obviously do it near the Grove quarters where. There's no, that. you go to your local Starbucks and just do it in the bathroom. Or just go to Craggy's place. Yeah, that too. Order one of Mister Fox's uh, chop shops. <laughs> What's he chopping? Don't hopefully, ask that. Yeah, hopefully someone that's dead. Yeah, the, th the thing is, all the evidence we've gathered is kind of it's mostly superficial. It could just be like, we're coming in while she's redecorating. Which is the argument she would probably make. Well, then what put the, the uh... mirror in the same room and see what happens. I get Witch Stalker to smell those blinds, or those uh, curtains, rather, that are moist. Yeah, the flowing curtains. Uh, Roman Perception, with advantage, because... Uh... Keen smell for doggers. For puppers, the best. That's GM. That's yeah, but I did. Uh, he rolled a 22. Or he didn't roll a 22, he got a 22. But you rolled 22 on a d20. Wow. He got a 22. <sighs> Unnatural. Hmm. Smells of rain. Oh. Fog. <laughs> it hasn't rained here in a while. Hmm. It certainly hasn't rained inside a single room. I don't think about myself. Maybe someday. I could have uh, snow in my own room and then I die. Abigail, and your hunting does sound familiar. Familiar not can't say it is, but there's gotta be something with us. You and Abigail begin inspecting the curtain and the mirror combo. Like, if we look at the room on the bottom right, you know it's uh was it four by three by four? Yeah, with and like whatever. That those bottom six squares, those spaces. There's only two things in that entire half of the room. And that's mm -hmm. the mirror and the folding curtain. On the on the ground or anything, does it seem wet? It does. But only to a certain uh like tri I don't want to say triangle, that's not. Only to a certain like segment of the room. So like a we, cone effect? Sort of. It's uh I'll, I'll draw this might make it easier. So if we imagine this yellow line as the, the vanity mirror. Whoop. And the folded curtain is like zigzag. Then the we'll make it this uh thank you. It's uh, really no actually no, it's, it's the same color as the background. Uh let me look at this orange color. Then the wet effect only goes up to like here. Maybe a bit past, but that's not. It's more so behind the curtain. Okay. Uh, can I try to put my hand into the mirror? You gotta of put your hand in the mirror. Magic shit. <laughs> that's um, what we're gonna do. Uh, you know Van Helsing with uh, Hugh Jackman 
and uh, uh it's a criminally movie. underrated movie yes was it, it wasn't natalie portman right who's uh, <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, 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 uh thank you thank you yeah you know how they're in... most gorgeous that was a pretty good outfit uh you know how in <laughs> van helsing when van helsing tries to go God, to the, the the well dracula's castle he has to put his hand in the mirror and it's like sort of like that frosty effect and like he is so pushing cool. into it but there's like resistance that's what happens for you it's not like a frozen layer though of resistance it's more like uh it's like a breaking water tension uh captain you may want to come here he Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Nope. What in I'll the hell? Here. Nope. I'll screw it up. <laughs> it's really everyone in the room. Hacker doesn't care. Oh, Hacker's not coming in. Hacker don't care. Hacker's <laughs> grumpy because he's hungry. Oh, he's Acker. angry. For a baby. Hacker hangry. <laughs> uh, who's closest to the cat? Uh, looks like Wallace. Oh, three of us. Yeah, no, why is Aminius in Russia and you hear the captain some, uh... I can't call them incantations, can't fully call them prayers. It, you know, it's more like saying, like, you know, God's breath, you know, in real life, or like, oh, like, oh, by the Lord, you know, like, these sort of religious expletives. Okay, so like it's that. like a... Jesus yeah. saved me. <laughs> Jesus saved me. Yeah. You all right there, Mr. Captain? captain? Oh, that is concerning. Hey, see why we're going through all the hoops here. <laughs> Wait here, I'm gonna get some more. Fuck this, I'm going to get my platoon. Oh. Okay. Uh, How long do you think it's gonna take you to get there and get back? Oh my gosh, my... let her know that we found anything, lest it is likely to run. He holds up a uh, poiky hand. Do not worry. There's a reason that I was given the, the duty today. It is my platoon that patrols around here. They're already out here. Oh, that's lovely. Oh, that's handy. <sighs> well, see, in the meantime, it's sort of... I'm assuming it's magic. I mean, I feel like that's pretty obvious. It's magic! What sort of mirrors but... do you have back home that do this? That are not magic? Yeah. I'm, I'm really curious. I was just gonna say, are we able to like try and because through wizardly you, way, are we able to try can, and determine what kind of you your hand does go through a Russian, like mm -hmm. it's, it's just like pushing through water tension, yeah, you know, I'll be uh, not, not like water tension, more like um, well, what's it called? Uh, Newtonian fluid water tension, you know, oh, yeah. I actually know exactly what you mean, yes. Yeah, like the yeah, it's like, it's like water water. stuff. Yeah, it's like when you Break. slap it, it, it's like a full-on wall, but if you slowly dig your hand into it, it just parts like, not full like wire, it's more like jello. Yeah, it's, it's like that. Bomb. Yep. Uh, you, your hand does pass through it, and you feel straight up like a different climb on the other side. Like, climb it. Okay. Oh, so happy uh, where the water is coming pulls from. Pulls out a okay. shield, puts it on, grabs some rope, ties it around himself. Okay, who's holding it? Acker! Yeah, we can do it. You wanna hold the rope? Come hold the rope. No. It's Russian! Oh, what's up? Why did you say so? Oh, for God's sake, you're hoping his like favoritism. <laughs> Obviously, oh, it good. works. What? Come on, you can't. You honestly can't say that you didn't expect him to pick favorites. The guy that can speak hey, giant yeah. to him, first person to be met. better stick together, you know. Exactly. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay. Excuse me. Okay. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> All right. <laughs> Meanwhile, Tana's just crammed in the corner. Yeah. Like, this <laughs> no, is fine. <laughs> that was cool. Him. I'll just, I'll just be here, tucked into this wall. Yeah. <laughs> chill. No big deal. I chill by, the, the by the sense. You can move. If you fart right now, I'm I will stab you. Today. I can get stuck like five minutes ago. Smack. Hey, well, if I uh, don't come back, 
and he's gone. <laughs> well, <laughs> he moved, there you go. He actually moved himself into the fog of war. <laughs> Smart. <laughs> How many rushes do I have? Uh, you don't die while going through the portal. You die after you go on the other side. Uh, how about I move you to Whispers and we can talk about what you may or may not see on this. Well, that's a good spot to stop.